<laughs> Thank you very much for listening to the show. And now it's straight over to the local radio news headlines. Yes, thank you very much. Police in Paris and Edwards are searching for a man seen standing in a bus stop whilst holding two enormous <laughs> bottles of milk. Yeah. Detective Inspector Terry Teets said the man should not be approached as he could be dangerous, deluded and married to a horrible old cow. The President of the Royal Society for the Cow and Protection of Milk, or Mr Bottle Top, said the man had every right to be holding the enormous milk bottles as long as he bought and paid for them and didn't drink the milk all in one go. The police spokesman, and Mr. Mickey Milkshake, said the police would be stepping up their patrols around the area where the man was seen in a desperate attempt to apprehend him before any more people are shocked and alarmed. Anyone with important information should immediately call Ernie, who drives the fastest milk car in the West. <laughs> Two little old grannies who witnessed a shocking sight immediately fainted and were rushed to hospital where they were promptly treated by a Dr. Paul Laudawan. We're told of his day, the two little old grannies fainted once more and had to be urgently treated by the renowned German specialist, a Dr. Wilhelm Milken von Tietensqueezer. When told of his name, the two little old grannies instantly jumped out of bed and demanded to be allowed to go and milk some cows. Dr. Wilhelm Milken von Tietensqueezer was delighted with their quick recovery and instantly discharged them from hospital. Police are working on the theory that the man could be obsessed with buying and drinking milk. Another theory being explored is that the man could simply enjoy holding enormous bottles of milk at a bus stop in an attempt to impress people and make them think he is an expert at squeezing teats. Police cannot allow this shocking behaviour to go on any longer, <laughs> and they will not sleep at night until the crazed lunatic is caught, captured and convicted. The prime suspect of this moment in time happens to be none other than a Mr. Kenny Squeezum. And he lives at One Bottle Top Terrace, Cow Close, Milky Way, Curdington. If arrested and convicted, he must never again be allowed to buy, drink or even look at a bottle of milk. But if caught doing so, he may have to milk every cow in Suffolk and deliver all the milk to Tesco Express before 6 o'clock in the morning, every day for a year. He must also pay £1,000 each in compensation to the children old grannies who so callously alarmed. They are recovering at a care home situated right next to a field full of cows with extremely large udders. The police are delighted this sad and sorry case is finally closed so they can concentrate on more serious crimes and arresting real criminals such as people who don't drink milk and people who have never milked a cow. <laughs> <laughs> the end.